absolutely. I mean, we came over, you know, together during the COVID season, right at the deadline, and um, our first experience with the uh, with the Orioles was the same. I mean, we went out to the alternate site and uh, got to experience that, and you know, our relationships, you know, kind of evolved from there, and it's it's become a pretty good friendship. Your dad mentioned you growing up around big names, Jim Tomey, Joe Maurer. Do you have any special memories of some of those bigger guys? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, um, anytime you're in the cage uh, with these guys, and there's, you know, some of the coaches' kids have have had the same, for, uh, you know, opportunities here. Um, anytime you're, you know, in those situations, you, you kind of, you know, cling to those memories. And, um, you know, I can remember putting balls on tees for Jim Tomey, you know, in the middle of games. And I can remember, you know, picking up cages after guys were, would, uh, you know, hit and just being able to listen to the conversations and, you know, listen to the camaraderie between all those guys. And, you know, they had a great clubhouse then. And it's something that, you know, I think is pretty cool and that we have here. With that being a pretty natural upbringing for you, was there anybody who ever kind of left you starstruck? Or is there anybody now that if you met them, you'd be a little blown away? Um, I, I don't know if starstruck's the right word. I think, it, you know, there's some times where, you know, when the Yankees would come into town at the time where you have like the big personalities like Derek Jeter, A-Rod, um, where it was like a little bit more like, oh, oh dang, these guys, you know, have won World Series and uh, MVPs and all that stuff. Um, but at the same time, you know, the Twins had a great team and um, they had MVPs, they had batting champions. And so I don't think Star Trek's the right word, but there are definitely some times where it's like, wow, it's pretty cool seeing, you know, Ichiro come in or seeing A-Rod come into the, the you know the cage and and uh, just being able to watch them work, but uh, I don't think I don't think necessarily starstruck.